good afternoon. We are here to test out a product that is uh, going to be cleaning brake calipers. All right, there are a lot of products for detailing the the, the, the car body works. All right, but there are not many products that will actually clean up the brake dust. Right, so what we have here is a very heavily stainted, okay, uh, brake caliper with the dust and oil and all that. In a short while, we will be taking out the wheel and then uh, we'll be cleaning it okay we're going to be doing a couple of process first of all we're going to be spraying this product onto the, onto the brake caliper and then just rinse it with water and see how it goes all right uh if it's still not clean we're going to attempt to do a second time and then we are uh, using a brush or even a cloth to clean it okay uh i got no idea how is this going to be turning out all right so i'm going to be i'm keen also to see how find out um what this product is all about okay tell us a little bit about this product jeffrey Okay, uh, this product is a wheel cleaner from GM Tech. It's a local manufactured product. And uh, I, in fact, I tested on my car, I love it. So oh. we're gonna try on a more, much dirtier rim. Let's yeah. see how it goes. Yeah, like this one, okay? Mm. So, all right, let's start the process, okay? We're gonna be uh, taking out the rim and then uh, I'm gonna continue by showing you the first step of spraying onto the caliper, all right? Okay, today we are trying out this uh, product for the wheel cleaner from GM Tech. It's um, a lot of people say it works tremendously well. We will see how it goes. We actually just spray on the this and the calipers, and we're just going to leave it for about three minutes there, and we're just going to rinse it and see how it goes. But if a uh, heavy stains, we recommend it to scrub. Then it should looks better. But we do without scrub first, one, and let's see how it goes. Right. So uh, if you look at the earlier pictures I posted, that was the original uh, condition of the brake caliper with all the dirt and, and uh, oil stained uh, black on it. And uh, what we have done is that this is the first step. We're going to just spraying the cleaner onto the brake caliper and then just rinsing it with water and see how effective is this product. Okay. If you got uh, pressure jet water, it will be much better, you know. So we it's not bad. It's quite good. No, so but yeah. still got the tough yes. zig. So we still, need to brush still need to brush it. it. All right. So um, I think Jeffrey, why don't we just brush it without using the cleaner and see what happens? Sure, we'll go there. Okay, now just 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 brush it and see how it goes. And if we need to, we put a second apply. Then, yeah, uh, the brush is horrible now, yeah. so it's good. It should have a <laughs> look better. <laughs> well, uh, the economy is not very good now, so we have to make use of whatever brush that is there. <laughs> <laughs> well, this proves that the product is good, right? Yeah, I mean, if we are using a good brush, then we can say that the brush is good, right, now, Jeffrey? Yeah, yeah. And uh, the owner of this car have not put TLC on this car for years so you can't blame it it's yeah thick. that's right okay let's oh it's looking good actually okay I'm going to show Jeffrey's face a little bit to prove that he's doing it okay yeah sweating all right give okay. it a smile to the camera please yeah all right okay we can just rinse off okay I think you should use a water jet just to shoot it then it's yeah. okay. It's looking good. Okay. I think probably we need another spray okay. on it and yeah. then using the brush the second time. I think that yeah. would give it a perfect uh, cleaning on this part. It, sh yeah. it should have a toothbrush, it be much better. Yeah. So, yeah, and this part here stay in here. So, yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Let's do it another spray. Okay. You know, I'm just curious why the color turns purple. That's a reaction with the brake uh, dust. Does all okay. product works the same way? I'm not so sure. So far, it seems like uh, I use industrial cleaner. It doesn't do this one works well. Right. Okay. So we're going to leave it there for just a couple of seconds, and then we're going to no? we're going to brush it. Use the water. Yeah. Uh, 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 right. Uh, 
Jeffrey now is going to use a piece of cloth instead of the brush to see how effective is this. Well, it's definitely better than the brush. Huh? Okay, looking good, huh? Yep. <laughs> now you say this one has not been cleaned for ages, so... So after this, uh, Jeffrey, do we need to wax it or something? Is there, is there another layer of coat that we yeah. need to spray on it? I'd say you're not required, but if you want to, you can put a water repellent coating. This is a wax that spray on only. Okay. Then the dust will not actually stick on the, the thing that is. It's really looking good now, yeah. Jeffrey. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So afterwards, we're going to uh, so called ask the owner to see whether he's happy with it. All right. So this is a very quick, simple job. Yeah. Of course, we are not using a water jet to uh, clean it off, which is definitely be more effective. But uh, okay. I think right now, just a simple test that we're doing here uh, really proves that this product is wicky working good. Yep. I'm not sure how long will it last, Jeffrey? It, it lasts pretty long. I, I tried on my car and I love it. Okay. Okay. Yep. It's All done. right, man. This is really looking good. Huh? All right, <laughs> it's, it's looking good. No way, we will do the rim also. One side only. Looking good. Uh, it's very, very... It looks brand new. Uh. Uh, yeah. All right, as you can see, this is really great. I think the cleaning job is really good. So let's draw a bit of conclusion. Uh, what do you think, Jeffrey? Okay. As you can see, the result is there. But normally, you do not remove the rim. This is for demo. We remove the rim. But then, then again, if you have a high pressure water jet, you don't have to remove. You just spray it and spray it. It will work well. So the same. Right. Okay, try it out. Okay. All right. Right, so what we have done now is to bring the rim to the cleaning area. Uh, I'm going to use the same product to clean up this rim and see how it goes. Okay, so uh, later on I'm going to switch the camera around and then I would like to show you the stain first. Okay, okay this is a close up shot of the rim. I want to show you the extent of the dirt that is uh, stained onto the rim. Obviously, this uh, rim has not been taken care of. All right, it has not been properly cleaned in the past. Okay, and uh, we are keen to see right now the this uh, cleaning agent is going to be cleaning up this uh, rim effectively. All right, here we are. We have got uh, Jeffrey again. All right, uh, using the same product, is it Jeffrey? Yes. yes All the right. Same product. We're just going to spray it over. Okay. And leave for a few minutes. Let's go. Oh. Yeah, I purposely zoom in to the area that uh, Jeffrey has sprayed. You can see it's already turning purple. Yeah, so Jeffrey is uh, continue to spray the rest of the area. Yeah, so as he sprays, you can see that it's already turning purple, right? Yeah. So that is the reaction uh, of the liquid cleaning up the rim, yeah? That's right. Okay, I'll just leave it. Okay, in a short while, we'll be using the water to rinse it off and see whether we need to use a wipe a cloth to clean it. We're going to rinse it off so, now? So, yeah. Okay. okay. Let's see how it goes. Most of it is out, but some of the stubborn is still there. We need to use cloth it up. Yeah, at the edges, yeah? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, so you can see that the edges uh, stains are still there. 
but uh, overall it has cleaned up quite a fair bit okay so obviously a little bit of brushing uh, and using the cloth to wipe off the the stain areas uh, obviously this rim is going to be looking really good man right yeah so here Jeffrey uh, we are not giving it another coat of uh, cleaner so we are just going to use a cloth to clean it and see right. whether it's going to be effectively taking away the stain looks like it could yeah it can yeah it can but uh, I think we could put another yeah. one it's easier mm. Okay, let's put another Jeffrey, coat you, and wipe it. Uh, do you want to put the rim uh, flat on the flo on the floor so yeah, maybe it's can. easier? Yes. Okay. All right. Yeah, I think that's better. Okay. Since the, the stain is so stubborn, we we'll just put one more coat and wipe it away. All right. and leave for some reaction yeah okay we're going to just leave it for uh just maybe just one minute now so so we'll come back to it yeah okay we're going to just wipe it mop it away i'm i prefer cloth because it's not so abrasive so it won't damage your rim paint work or anything like that much much better now Hey, and this product is so uh, friendly it doesn't hurt your skin or anything like that strong but yeah. not abrasive wow rim is looking good man yeah. Wow, it's looking good. Mm -hmm. Done, we rinse it off. Okay. Okay, so we're going to finally just rinse it off. Okay, done. Okay, so in conclusion, I want to ask Jeffrey about this product. Okay, first of all, I'm going to show you the rim. Okay, can, as you can see, well, I think it has really done quite a fine job now, really. Yeah. So Jeffrey, what is your take uh, when we compare that uh, of the cleaning of the caliper and now cleaning the rim? What do you think? Is it up to your expectation? Well, I'm actually very happy with the product. Okay, but uh, if those stubborn one, you can actually use brush or use cloth and get it. That's why we use the cloth. Right. So, and um, I think the next wash, you don't have to use the wheel cleaner anymore. You can just hose it off. Right. Yeah. Don't trust what I say. Get it one and try for yourself. Okay, so this is the product from GM Tech. Okay, so I'm going to conclude by showing a before and after pictures uh, right at the end uh, of the brake caliper before cleaning and after, and you can make a comparison with it. I've also taken shots of the rim before and after, uh, so that will give you an, a, a feel about uh, how effective this product. All right, for now. Okay. See Cheers. you soon. Bye bye.